What up guys, Jay Pops in the house coming at you again with another top five video. And today we're doing top five Disney Pops. All right guys, so this is another continuation of cool ideas that you guys thought of. You guys put in the comment sections, top five Stranger Things would be cool, top five Heroes vs. Villains, which we just did. And now we're gonna do top five Disney Pops. So I first thought I couldn't do this list because I love all my Disney Pops, but then I was going through them and I was like, okay, I think I have like some favorite ones or ones that I think are just really cool. Like, I'll show you, we'll just, we'll just start. <laughs> I guess it's just another one of them. All right, so coming in at number five would be Dumbo with Timothy. Now, I feel like you guys probably wouldn't see Dumbo on too many people's top five lists, but this is the Disney Treasures exclusive Dumbo. And who doesn't like Dumbo? Dumbo is just awesome. I just think it's unique. You know, you remember the scene where Dumbo's flying and his ears are all out and they gave him the translucent stand there so it actually looks like he is flying. When you take pictures of him outside, it makes for a really, really cool picture. I have him all the way up at the top. You guys can't really see him sometimes in the videos, but he's up there on top of a mystery mini can and it just looks cool. Look for the display out of box, in box. It looks really cool. So he came in at your number five spot. <laughs> but, uh, mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I'm trying to be sincere for once and it feels like you're distracted. No, no, no way. Really? Because you're looking at me like I have a... Uh, shark head. All right, so coming in at number four, fairly new pop, but I think they did an awesome job with it. And Sharkhead Maui, ECCC exclusive. I did a review on this, and I just think he's awesome. He's detailed, really nice. He's got like the 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 leaves and the rope around him. He's even got the shark tattoo down there. You can see his fish hook here. It even show his. I couldn't show you last time too well, but he's got his tattoo showing that's even on his feet. And I just think he's really cool. His, and his eyes aren't fully like round, pop out or anything. They kind of cut it off and give him that, you know, like that worried look. But I think it's an awesome character. It was a funny movie. Um, I like the pop a lot. So that's number five, uh, four, Sharkhead Maui. Okay, so coming in at number three is one of my favorites, and you know he had to make the list. I would put him higher up on the list, but then that would just be, be me being partial. So it is Stitch 626. I love this pop because he's so true to the movie. He's got four, six actually, arms and legs, I guess you would call them, four arms, two legs, and he's holding the lasers, or guns, lasers, whatever you want to call them. This is from the scene where he just, I think he crashes the red one and he's on earth and it's raining and he's just like ready to fight as Stitch always is. And I just think it's so true to the movie because the first pop that came out was very large and he had like really big ears. Awesome pop just because you love Stitch the character. Then they come out with this and it's so true to the movie. They got the, he's got the little wrinkle over his nose. They even gave him the little grimace and his eyebrows are even up and they gave him a different color there. His ears are a really good size in the antennas. And I love the first pop too, just because it's classic. It's a classic, you know, Funko pop where it's just like a basic, you know, pop. So that is number three, Stitch 626. <laughs> Okay, so coming in at number two is something fairly new, but I had to throw him on the list because I just think he is an awesome 
pop. He's a cool character in The Incredibles 2, and this is Frozone. Funko did a really good job with this pop. This isn't something like you would normally see like on a common. I feel, I feel like this is something like an exclusive. Like this would have been exclusive to Hot Topic, and then they would have made like just a bland one with him in his outfit or you know something. But I think this is really cool, and I'm not saying that they haven't made really cool common pops because they have. But I just feel like. They outdid themselves on this one. He's got the ice shooting out of his hand and he's kind of, you know, sliding on the ice. Another cool thing about Frozone is he doesn't have eyes. Like he has eyes, but they're covered. And you don't normally see that with Pops. You usually see, you know, the round black eyes, white eyes, whatever color they want to give him. But he has his eyes fully covered. He kind of reminds me of like the Star Trek guy. And it's just fully covered with the blue there. So that, I thought that was pretty unique too with him. I just think it's actually pretty cool. So awesome pop, done very well. He, he made the top five Frozone from The Incredibles. Coming in at your number one spot would be something again fairly new, and that is Wally. Box Lunch exclusive, Earth Day exclusive, Wally. I think this is really cool. They gave him the plant from the scene where he gives Eve the plant. And this is actually a really cool pop because it's a recycled pop. Part of it is recycled. I think like 20% of it is um, recycled. So it's actually really, really cool. I love the way they made the eyes and his head tilt and everything. And I just think it's an awesome pop. The color on it and everything is really true to Wally. Very awesomely detailed with the hands extending or the arms extending as compared to like the first pop they did, which I still want that pop. I don't have it, but I am going to go looking for that pop. Um, so Wally takes the number one spot. So now I didn't put some characters like Mickey and Woody. Woody by far is one of my favorites too. Um, but I feel like these characters, there's just something unique about every single one of these pops. Um, so these pops made the top five of my favorite Disney pops. And if you guys have any top five favorite Disney pops, um, put it in the comment section. Or if you guys have a particular one of these that you really like, put it in the comment section and let me know. So J-Pop signing off. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for tuning in. And as always, do not forget to like, share, and subscribe.